Many authors believe that the reptilian Anunnaki warriors of ancient Sumeria, who invaded the Caucasus Mountains, have secretly continued to control mankind via the worldwide network of secret societies, which are loosely described as the Illuminati. more ancient than the Mayan kingdoms of Central America, older than ancient Greece, and predating the pharaonic dynasties of Egypt, the Sumerian Empire was formed more than 6,000 years ago, stretching from the Indus Valley region in Pakistan to the capital called Uruk. Sumeria is known as the cradle of civilization. It was here that white-skinned peoples from the Caucasus Mountains spread a worldwide cult of blood ritual and magic to the rest of the world. Two authors, Zechariah Sitchin and the British genius John Marco Allegro, who translated large parts of the Dead Sea Scrolls, studied ancient Sumerian clay tablets which were discovered at Nineveh in the 1800s. These clay tablets told the history of the Sumerian Empire, an empire which was formed by invading aliens called the Anunnaki. Sumer's original name was Ki M. Gir which means the land of the kings with blazing rockets. Sumerian clay tablets describe the Anunnaki aliens genetically manipulating mankind and creating a hybrid race of alien reptilian humans who became known as the Nephilim. The Nephilim are also known as the Elohim in the Bible. This was a genetically created race of rulers which had their human DNA mixed with that of the invading Anunnaki aliens. References to this race of alien hybrid rulers can be found in ancient texts from around the planet. The Sumerian Empire was the place where Zoroastrian, Hindu, and Judaic religions all began. The hybrid alien-human rulers became known as the Zazumin, Rephaim, and the Anakim. The world's most famous author on the subjects of the occult and human consciousness is David Icke. In his books, The Biggest Secret and Tales from the Time Loop, David Icke reports that blood sacrifice was an important part of ancient cultures in Babylon and also in Central America. In the legends of Babylon, the kingdom of ancient Iraq, which supplanted Sumeria, the drinking of human blood and the sacrifice of children was performed to please the alien gods who had invaded from the stars. The ancient ruling elite believed that drinking human blood allowed them to absorb human DNA from their ancestors. The Vatican continues this ancient blood drinking ritual to this day with the symbolic drinking of the blood of Christ. David Icke claims blood drinking rituals have been performed by members of the royal political elite throughout history. <laughs> 